Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Sagittarian Sun, Moon, and Rising. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for this wonderful, wonderful um, help and support through the years. Um, please remember to like and share these videos. I want to say I'm wishing you guys all the luck in the world and this is going to happen for you Sagittarius in this year because it's going to be wonderful wonderful positive energy so whatever has transpired in your life whatever that has been going on in your life there is going to be a lot of changes that are coming in and your energy vibration for the year is wonderful positive energy so um this year for you guys um is going to be good because you have the raw the you know a lot of luck coming in the star and uh, and and the energies of good fortune good situation there's a lot of things that is ending there's a lot of cleaning up that is going on in your life and this is going to be good the energy of this year it is the energy of the an air element air element you are a fire element so <coughs> sorry whatever the situation is you have the energy vibration of uh, justice justice is an air element energies justice uh, is a year of imbalance whatever that was imbalance in your life uh, it is now going to be balanced out it's going to be very positive good uh, um, positive energies which are coming in and this is going to be extremely good so this is wonderful to have the sort of energy that is coming in um, for you Sagittarians this is um, extremely extremely good so ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you all if you'd like to have a personalized reading please go on my website and order a reading the, the, the um, year reading is very good for you um, guys and you can also ask for a birthday reading but yet still a year reading will show you what to expect in the next year that is coming up um, I um, want to say to each and every person please listen to your Sun moon and rising sign if you'd like to do donations you can do um, a dollar donations or whatever if you have found this channel to be wonderful and has been helpful throughout the years you can um, do a donation and you can also like and share these videos and share whatever you would like to do um, I want to say to each and every person I'm so grateful for your help I am sorry that I can't um, um, I can't <laughs> um, um, address each and every person individual but um, I want to thank you so so much and I'm wishing you all the luck and love in the world and this is going to be very positive so let's go in your reading and let's see what is happening but before we do that please write these numbers down and these dates down um wonderful energies are coming in for you and february is a very lucky month in february you have a whole lot of luck and may you have luck in these two lucky months of the year because February and May is a lucky lucky month as we move forward and we look at uh, um, the next energy that you have the next very positive very lucky day is going to uh, a month is going to be in November okay November is going to be a very lucky positive day for you the um, October and November is going to be very very positive for you um, Sagittarians so whatever is happening whatever is going on the, these two days are going to be extremely lucky and positive December is going to be really really December this the year 2018 begin with a tower and ends with debt and transformation for some people um, I'm sorry to say this but for some people in the month of December there is going to be people who are living your life to and passing over to the spirit world there's debt that is going to come in in the month real debt somebody dying and passing over to the spirit world is going to happen in the month of December this comes up um, with the energy I'm seeing a lot of sadness um, a lot of endings that is coming in in the month of December so you're starting this year off with a tower where you're you're releasing a lot of stuff that were holding you back and um, 
as I look, um, um, you know, your best month, you, 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 all your, your luck fall on the best month, the luckiest month, which is February, May, and um, August and November, say um, October and November is very, very good. As I look at um, your year, there is not a, a lot of there's a lot of positive energies in the sense that there's a lot of supporting energies that are coming in. You have the energy of the the tower, which is very good, and you have the wheel of fortune, another excellent energy, and you have your own energy vibration in October, which is very very wonderful, and then you have. Uh, um, another fire energy in November which is good this the, these are very very good positive months for you guys so this is um, really really a wonderful wonderful experience a wonderful month and wonderful time of the year your numbers is going to be 17 16 10 21 and 7 and 8 Okay, so again, um, 7, 8, 10, 17, um, 16, and 21. So these are going to be positive. So let's go ahead and look at your reading and see what is happening. A very good month for January because whatever that was blocking you, whatever that was holding you back in your life, whatever that has been stunting your growth is actually going to release it's as if uh, the energy of the tower comes to cleanse uh, all that was holding you back all that was working against you all that was uh, um you know bringing you down all that was uh, stopping your progress uh, um all of what was going on you are going to see that in january all of these things uh, it's a crash it's a uh, um, an explosion all of these things are moving away out of your life and this is going to be in a positive way because in the month of February the luckiest month of the year one of the luckiest month of the year we have the energy of the star and this is good this energy of the star is a positive wonderful energy because in the month of February you are going to see that you are just bringing out certain aspects certain situations you are just um, glowing you are just being positive it's going to be a very powerful positive month the month of September is for you guys so this is going to be extremely good and extremely positive and wonderful so um, be aware of this that your luck is going to actually um, begin to come out in February in March another wonderful energy the earth energy this is good because you're ending that quarter with the energy vibration of an art hurt energy because you're vibrating in an energy and where the world is the hair energy and you need to be black balanced some of the time because you have the 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 fire energy in the beginning and then in the middle you're all the way up in cloud and now you have to come back and ground and balance so in March you are going to find out that this energy is is working with you to help you bring balance so the first quarter I should say is not bad it's very good because actually um, there's a cleansing there's things that are being moved out of your life and positive new things are coming in let's look at your second quarter we begin in the second quarter with the energy of the magician and this is positive because with the energy of the magician what is happening is that you are being blessed with the gifts if you're thinking about starting something in March go ahead if you're thinking about starting something in February yes go ahead because this is going to be extremely extremely successful as we look at May, another lucky month in this year, we have the Wheel of Fortune. So in May, luck is going to be coming at you. This is going to be extremely positive. This is going to be a, a wonderful time for most of you because the energy of luck is coming in for you. A lot of things are going your way. Things are working out in ways that you weren't expecting. So this lucky period, this lucky um, period is coming up and it's going to be extremely positive so you need to take time and use up all the energy and all the luck that is coming in for you in May in June it's going to be a month of um, relaxation 
um, a month that you're going to connect with yourself you're going to be finding what is my true part which direction which way I should go and this is going to be extremely good because what is going to happen is that you by by connecting with yourself you're going to find your true inner light and you're going to know exactly what direction to take in your life and it's going to be extremely positive and extremely good so the second quarter is one of your best best quarters so from april until june is one of your best quarter which you're going to see positive good situation good energies are coming to wonderful um, vibrating energies because what is happening here is that you are going to be blessed with the first the first in the first month you're going to be blessed with the gifts of uh, um all that you need to move on and then the second month you are going to have the wheel of fortune and then this is going to be extremely extremely positive as we move forward in the month of July we need to be looking at certain things and certain aspects in our lives because we have the energy of uh, um, the moon coming up and this is not the psychic this is uh, um, you know seeing your enemies your fire and seeing people who are trying to stop you in whatever way they're trying to do this and this energy of the moon is really coming up to show you um, people who are people and things that you should be aware of and um, uh, be aware of them and kind of stay out of their ways these are people um, that is as if your your guides and angels are showing them up to you so that you can be aware and know that these people are not really um, friends uh, because uh, they are more of uh, um, um, trying to to find um, you know what find ways and mean um, to you know get you down it's not uh, in, a, in a positive way they're not working in a positive way they're as if uh, they're looking for ways of means uh, um, to get you down so you need to be um, you need to be realistic because um, sometimes you can meet people and these people have a way of uh, um, they have a way of pretending and um, you're not seeing um who they are and what is happening is that the universal angels and guides are coming up and saying you know be aware not everyone who lasts with you are really truly your friends so this is what is happening for you in july as we move on and that's a water energy so a lot of emotional situation as we move on um August is a very very good month for you August you're balancing out things and this is this is wonderful this is positive in August you're really balancing out things you're trying to bring things um, to a balanced place in your life you're trying to find how you are going to take on other project and getting things uh, settled down because the first half of the year was wonderful it was good but now you're coming back to yourself because you have defeat your enemies and you're coming back to yourself and this is going to be very good and very positive so August is a very good month for you guys okay as we look at September September as I said and I've seen in the readings for a lot of people September is a month where breakthroughs information things are going to be coming out in September's breakthrough information things that you weren't expecting unexpected things but these things are going to be good because these things are going to strengthen you these information are going to strengthen you and give you positive energy to move forward and this is going to be extremely good so these are wonderful situation this breakthrough that is coming um, out is good because there are things that needed to come out and there are things that you needed to know about and these are going to be happening for you so wonderful positive energies are coming out and good things are about to happen in your life and this is going to be good okay um, so it's you know the, th the third half is like the changing of the guards because what is happening is that you're defeating all your enemies you're finally bringing them and defeating all your energies and you're balancing this out by doing it in a positive way and um, doing it in a way where 
you are not creating any karmas or any sort of a situation for yourself you're doing it in, in a positive way because you're protecting yourself as we look at the last quarter of the year in the month of October you are going to find inner strength this inner strength is going to be wonderful because what it's going to do it's very positive it's going to bring you to a place where you're connecting with yourself where you're understanding certain things and knowing and feeling what is going on and this is going to be extremely positive so this is a wonderful wonderful positive energies for a lot of people and this is your energy vibration so it is going to bring you a lot of luck too here it's going to bring you a lot of luck so as we look at November another wonderful wonderful month for you guys positive yes whatever you decide to do in in November go ahead and do it because it's going to happen um, a lot of people are going to think about buying new houses about moving about uh, bringing closures to a lot of things and this is going to be good you're going to be transforming yourself you're going to be moving to different places you're going to be connecting and doing all these wonderful things so this is this you know these are going to be very good because a lot of people are going to think of buying new houses and you're going to be balancing out things and thinking about buying new houses and making and preparing yourself for the year 2019 so this is going to be good a lot of people I see a lot of people selling and buying houses or moving from out rent apartments into new houses for themselves and this is going to be good um, I see um, in a month of what was that in a month of September you are uh, you will receive information and then with that information um, you think in um, the month of uh, um october that yeah i'm going to buy a house you know i'm going to do this i'm going to move i'm going to you know do this so this is happening for you guys so it's a good 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 energy because um what is happening is that success and victory or is coming and there's an ending there's an ending and a transition so in December this ending and this transition is going to come in your life accept this ending and transition because it's moving you to something much better and what it is moving you to is success and riches success and riches so this is going to be extremely extremely positive because a lot of success and riches and the endings are bringing you to something that is powerful and much more beautiful Beautiful. as I have said a lot of people will be um, hearing of that happening in your life um, and a lot of you a lot of um, people are going to be ending relationships with certain people who are um, of a lower energy vibration you're going to decide that you're moving some people out of your life and these can be cancers and scorpion you, some of you are going to be ending relationships with cancers and scorpion people in um, this uh, um, in, 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 in the year 2018 so and whatever is happening is that you have people uh, you know you can never get rid of all your enemies because as if when you end one section of these people and new new ones just spring up they're like cockroaches they're like crabs and that sort of a thing you see a crab a hole is empty a crab crawl out of his hole and then um, then comes another one you know it's, it's as if these people springs up like wild um, uh, mushrooms so you have to be aware of this there's always you're always going to be having enemies it's only until I think 2032 when people start to choose which direction they're going that you won't have this sort of energy anymore and year year 2018 which I am happy 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 to tell you it is the energy of the world so I love you guys though so I love you see you Sagittarians yes I do love you congratulations you're the first ones to receive the energy of the world and this is so positive so your year is going to be good and even though there is situation things and that sort of a thing that does come in you are going to be successful riches abundancy as I've said a lot of you are going to be buying and selling house a lot of you are going to be moving a lot of you are going to be ending things with information that you have received and that sort of a thing you begin the year 2018 with the energy of the towel you're letting go you're releasing you're healing and you end the year 2018 with a transformation 
transition and this transformation is going to bring you a lot of success and a lot of wonderful things in your life so this is a so so powerful congratulations you guys are the only one so far that has received the energy of the world and this is good so again I hope you have written down um, I hope you have written down um, the energies uh, for you guys okay we are going to look at the zodiac energy so let's look at the zodiac energies we are going to go look at the zodiac energies as energies of the Sun sign let's see what is happening Uranus and Mars a lot of career changes for a lot of you people in the first half of the year a lot of career changes for you people in the first half of the year um, and let's uh, look the Sun people are the people um, that was born between the ages of 12 a.m. and 6 p.m. and you have to deal with Uranus and Mars Uranus comes in to remove you out of a career that no longer serve you the energy of Uranus come in to move you out of a career that no longer serve you and this is positive and this is good so whatever the energy and whatever the situation is of was for you said people Uranus is going to bring you huge changes and career changes okay so let's look at the moon people what is going to happen to the moon people well, we have the energy of for the moon people we have the energy of um, Pisces and Leo so for you moon people you have the Pisces coming in to help you with your intuition um, the unseen world and you have the Leos coming in to help you as business partner and also friends and compatibility mates the compatibility mates are the Pisces uh, fire and water can work sometimes it depends it depends on your soul group and who you came in uh, and have a contract to be your soulmate or twin flame okay so this is going to be wonderful this is going to be positive this is going to be powerful for you guys so as we move forward um, as we move forward we are going to be looking at the ascension deck and let's see what is in the energy of the ascension deck let's see what the ascension uh, masters and goddesses have for you Sagittarians in the year 2018 and this the scene the Phoenix the Phoenix this is good this is extremely good people this is good this is good okay this is wonderful the Phoenix the Phoenix energy has always been on earth and watches over us the high princess array bought it from Atlantis and placed it within the status of the Phoenix in um, Egypt you receive a change of God force a charge of God force when you think about it and so relax and accept it the Phoenix um, contains the fifth dimensional records for the earth and the information within the cry the crystal skull you are invited to visit the tunnel from the Phoenix to all of earth a portal of wisdom links to the ascension aspect of Mars from here you can radiate peace and oneness through the universe I connect to the God force within the Phoenix I connect to the God force within the Phoenix it is so and it will be I connect to the God force within the Phoenix there is the confirmation ladies and gentlemen please read it please call up on the angels from the Phoenix um, for help and power and guidance is this is wonderful to start working with and start using this is a powerful energy to receive for you guys as we move forward as we move forward we are having the energy vibration 
as we move forward we are having the energy vibration for um as we move forward we're having the energy vibration for wonderful energy so let's look and see what is happening for you let's see what is happening for you um you have the queen of keys in reverse i seems to be getting and receiving these cards in the reverse you have the the queen um of keys in reverse but anyway what i've learned about these new cards because i haven't gone in depth of it is that when they come up in reverse it is um a good good thing so let's look at the queen of the keys in reverse the queen the queen of the keys in reverse the queen of the keys in reverse okay so let's go ahead and see what she is saying in the reverse form you could experience an emotional distancing from a businesswoman or have a difference of opinion or dispute with a woman in authority you or a woman you know may be thinking about quitting a job a higher position that you want may not be available or a position that you have earned may no longer be fulfilling for you in some cases this reverse can indicate being laid off or distancing in a love relationship regardless of how this reverse uh, manifests this is a time to consider your aspirations and all that brings you to your highest next step in life take note when the queen or king of keys appear in the same reading but they didn't relationships you know so it could be a relationship and it could be but um what i'm feeling with this one is that um if you had apply for a job if you you know you might be having dispute with someone in 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 um you might be having dispute with a former or someone in authority whatever this dispute is and if you had applied for a job maybe it didn't uh, go to you and that sort of a thing whatever it is uh, um, this is going to be happening to some of you in this year so be aware of this and you know if something didn't go to you it wasn't meant for you so don't let people use that sort of a thing to manipulate you if it what well, if, if the job position didn't go to you it wasn't meant for you okay now let's look and see what the conscious spirit is all about conscious spirit balance i understand and embrace the opposite forces in life that brings about balance i understand i understand and embrace the opposite forces in life that bring balance and this is wonderful and this is positive and this is good okay so this is good it is good it is good so let's move forward and let's see what is happening with the angels of abundance let's move forward and see what's happening with the angels of abundance and we have um block out distractions i don't know but this energy of blocking out distractions are coming up for this year 2018 your life purpose and other priorities need your in, uh, in divided undivided attention at this time so it is time for you to take charge of your schedule and working environment by turning off electronic and avoiding anything that is distracting you from what is important you already know um, what these distractions are and you have the power to um, and 
um, be responsible for them okay you have uh, the color of gray the zebra black and white color for you guys in this year so whatever is going on whatever um, is affecting um, you around you and that sort of a thing whatever is happening this is good this is positive this is a really um, a positive sense for a lot of you guys here so I want to say again um, if you'd like to donate and make any donations if you'd like to have a personalized reading if you'd like to give someone a gift a, 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 a 2018 year reading is wonderful to do you can always go on my side and buy a gift certificate a lot of gift certificates are there I want to say thank you ladies and gentlemen for the wonderful support that you have supported me um, in 2017 and I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here and i'm wishing you all a wonderful wonderful 2018 whatever the situation is whatever is happening um know that you are going to be financially abundant in this year 2018 the energy of the world with endings new beginnings and success is coming to you namaste